my name is Nicholas Allen. I'm uh, here at Glasshampton Monastery and uh, I've been here about 16 years altogether. And I guess it's more my home than anywhere in the society, but I've, I've lived in different places, in Birmingham for a while, at Hillfield Friary and uh, in uh, Yorkshire. But uh, I keep coming back to Glasshampton. And here we have a place of quiet and retreat and people come for us, come to us for a few days at a time or just for a day and sometimes they want to talk to a brother, sometimes they want to sit and admire the view and watch what's going on in the garden. And uh, yeah, so this is my job, I'm the guardian here. I'm also the provincial secretary and the general secretary, so I've got plenty to keep me busy. And uh, but just the the work of the house, the cooking, the cleaning, gardening, that seems to be enough really. So this is my home. Hi, I'm Brother Martin. I'm one of the brothers here at Glasshampton and I'm blessed to be able to join in the stream of prayer here. And as part of that, uh, I look after the guests and I look after the garden and I'm definitely under obedience to our cat who's just around. Thank you. I'm Tobias and I'm in the second phase of my novitiate here at Glasshampton. It's the phase where I devote myself to a study and prayer and I'm really enjoying the study and living the prayer life here is an immense privilege. I, uh, I love the rhythm of this place, I love the kind of gentle flow of things at Glasshampton. Um, my studies are very broad, I've been looking at the history of Christian monasticism going right back to the Desert Fathers through Evagrius, Cassian, Benedict, Francis, right through, it's been fascinating. Um, and uh, as well as helping with all the practical stuff, all the cleaning and the washing, I also help out here in the sacristy in the chapel uh, with the help of the other brothers. I've been uh, looking after the setting up for all the offices and the services and it's been a really good experience and I've learned a lot from it. Your salvation is near to those who pray. The joy we've got about that. Your salvation. My name is Peter and I joined the community, the Society of St. Francis, in 2007. And originally I come from Latvia, the country that for many years, as you may know, was part of the Soviet Union, where religion, uh, all things metaphysical, all things mystical, were not encouraged, to put it mildly. And so my childhood, my upbringing, up to my mid-teens was rather secular. Um, however, the times change and the spirit moves and here I am, for which I'm very grateful. And so I've been, I've been living here at Glasshampton for, for nearly six years now. And among the things that I enjoy to do is DIY and maintenance especially the DIY, uh, the little projects uh, where uh, you design and build the whole thing from scratch, as it were. And uh, so if you succeed, it, it, it can become a very rewarding experience. So, yes, I'm very happy, very happy to be here. Hi, I'm, I'm Amos, and um, here I am at Glasshampton. Um, I came back here last year from two years in Leeds, um, where I was helping with the ministry there um, with asylum seekers. And I'm back in um, Glasshampton. I've been around different, different ministries. I've been in Africa for 10 years, East End of Glasgow for 10 years, so um, I've moved around. I find this place is, is very much my kind of home. I, I enjoy it here. I'm, I feel I've got uh, quite a, a calling to prayer, and that's what really makes my life tick. And apart from joining in the offices and the prayer, 
uh, prayer life here. I just fit in and do the chores. I do quite a lot of work in the gardening, actually. I'm enjoying gardening at the moment. But um, I'll help with the guests sometimes when uh, uh, Martin jumps away and do a bit of driving and um, this and that just to keep the place going. <coughs> do my turn cooking. I enjoy baking all the bread. And um, at the moment the uh, greenhouse is full of tomatoes and I'm going to be making some chutney later on. So that's the sort of thing um, I do here. I'm also an ordained priest, so I preside at the Eucharist, and I have a bit of um, a spiritual accompaniment ministry, and uh, a few talks every so often in different places. And that's really what makes up my life here at Glasshampton.